successful homestand, and they'll try to cap it off with the cherry tonight. Welcome back to EA Sports. Tender hangs on. Still lots of time left in the period. Still scoreless in this one. Hershey's got the win off that draw. Slides the puck over. Thunderous use of the body of the hit. You want to send a message to your opponent early in the game, and that early delivery of a bone-crushing hit, that does just that. Carries it across the line. Puts it on the and not much on that one. Quick feed down low. Oh, they he might have a step here. All alone. Great save. Moves the puck up to Huntington. quiet shot, James. What that means is the goaltender can't see it. So he's listening for it, and it buzzes right by him because he cannot catch up to it, can't find it with his eyes, and can't find it with his body. Hershey's got the game's first goal as it finally comes in the back half of period number one. Yeah, it's been a real tight opening period. Uh, both teams back and forth, defensive style of play here. But, James, they get the first goal at the back half of this first period. I expect things to open up now. A little more creativity to shine through. That makes the save. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. Up by one, and you take a penalty, applying some pressure to the PK unit here. Opportunity to get the equalizer. It's the first penalty kill for this team tonight, guys, and we know their unit is ranked towards the bottom of the league, but this team's confidence can sometimes overpower the skill that they show. So let's see what they can get going here right now. And he makes the save on that play. Looks to make a play over to Molestin. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Oh, an unbelievable stop by Shurinko. Picked up along the boards by Christie. Way too much congestion blocks that. And they continue to apply pressure here. Oh, CP, you know what he wanted there. Just came up a little wide. Well, JC certainly did. He pulled it into his body, and as he corrals it, he lets it rip. But hockey's a game of inches, and that one just misses. And we play on. Moves it to Abramov. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Moves it quickly over to Snively. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. Quick feed to Bitten. Denies him. He got all of it. Puck is frozen and will get a face off. The Bulldogs are in a great position halfway through the season, James, and you got to give credit where credit is due to the management group who looked and identified players on this roster that could work well together, and they acquired the pieces they needed to be a contender. Too much congestion in front. And he takes the feed. 
Taken along the wall by MP. And he takes a shot. And that's poked away. What a stop there. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Edler is able to steady his team defensively and still contribute points. McMichael's known to bring the offense for his team. I'll be watching these two players to see if one of them can really shine for their team tonight. Guys, back to you. Huntington's almost back on the ice. The Thunderbirds played along the wing. No scores! They've tied it up! Opportunity knocking, and they take advantage on the power play. Well, you spend so much time in practice working on it because you want to have different layers to throw off the PK units, and I thought they did a real effective job of reading what they were giving, and then they were able to bury it. Here in the late goings of the period, you can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. Takes it to the front. Whistle blows, stopping the play. McMichael's going off for interference. I really like them working off the 1 3 1 sequence that they were successful on earlier, James. It really opens up the ice. So you're using and stretching the entire zone. And listen, there's a lot of ice for the defense to cover. So you can look to the flanks, you can look to the bumper, but a lot of options off of it. The Thunderbirds gain control of the puck against the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Grabs the puck. Rips it off net. Puts it wide of the net. Well, this shot is really hard, James, but a nice reminder that if it isn't accurate, it doesn't stand a chance. Here's a short pass to Huntington. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Tries to clear the puck. And they get it out of harm's way. Sends the pass in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. And the puck clears the zone. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Quick pass to Gaudet. Gains the zone through the middle. Takes the feet at the back end. That goes off the post and stays out. Scores! And they've gone in front thanks to the power play goal. Well, it's all about manipulating the PK, and that's what they did so well to take advantage of that opportunity. That's exactly how the coach would have drawn it up, James. I mean, you move the puck around the outside to disrupt the coverage. You open up the middle of the ice, and then you get a glorious shot chance, and you capitalize. Excellent work. Springfield's gone up by one after that goal here in the first. Well, yeah, and it certainly changes the mindset. You got a little bit of jump to your step. You're more confident. Now you got to attack. You got to push when your opponent's down. Moves it to Pekka. And offside, we'll get a reset here. Springfield's looking to take this lead into the intermission here as they've put a lot of pucks on net so far. The Thunderbirds take possession after that neutral zone faceoff. And now it's grabbed by Bitten. Frisky's moving the puck through his own zone. To the front! Centering pass in front! and they can't complete the play. Both teams getting a good sweat on after this first period. We've got lots more in store, and we're coming back with a clean. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. All right, Pounder, how will you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? Hershey's trailing in this game because they haven't had any urgency around the puck. They've been chasing the game and they haven't had any possession time. The Bears have it now. Don't defense an effort to poke it away. Locked it. Moves it quickly over to Stifle. With the puck inside the defensive zone. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. He got all of that hit. Over. 
Too much traffic in the lane. Denies him! Stevenson styled in and anticipating the play so effectively, making a huge save from a dangerous spot on the ice. Denies that opportunity. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Springfield's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Here's a change. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a faceoff. Springfield's done a nice job of generating pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. The Bears win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. And that goes off course off a body. And some good footwork to kick it away. Scooped up along the wall by McElrath. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got it and challenged right away to make the save. Scrum along the wall. To McElrath. Handles the puck. Hooked away in the neutral zone. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Takes possession. Backhander in front. And he sacrifices his body to block the shot. Hershey's got it in their own zone. Shot. The blocker saved by Jurenko. Slides the puck over to Rush Correct. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Past the midway mark in this period, the Thunderbirds lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Taken by Tucker. And it's a quick pass to Holscher. Now a quick pass to Callen. Broken up by Dave. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. Beat the shooter, and that's exactly what he does. Oh, and he had the answer on that one. Tries to get it to Holscher. Backtracks with possession back inside the defensive zone. Springfield's going on the attack as they gain the zone. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Dishes it to Dave. Shot. Big stop right there. Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Officials are in position, and both teams are getting ready as they get set for another face-off here. And he's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. Fire it! Fire it! There's the buzzer bringing the second period to an end. Great night of hockey here on EA Sports. 